I can't see nothing, right? I am faded, bro. I didn't even see her face. She just ended up in front of me, right? This girl's a freak, bro. But yeah, bro, I'm doing all this crazy stuff. And she's letting me, bro. She's letting me. So this girl finally turns around. Y'all, this girl... What's bracken, what's cracking, what's happening, YouTube? It's that boy Gio coming at y'all with another video. I know it's been a little minute since y'all heard my voice, but you know what I'm saying? I'm here for y'all, you know what I'm saying? I'm here for y'all. And today, 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 <laughs> do I have a story time for y'all? This one takes the icing on the cake. Y'all are not going to get a story from me like this. In a minute. Cause I know y'all see the thumbnail. I know y'all see the title of the video. Y'all probably asking like, Yo, what are you, what are you, what are you talking about? What did you see? What did you experience? What did you saw? A what? What did you see? A gremlin? Don't worry about it. It's all finna be explained. But before the video starts, no kizzy. I'ma need y'all. I'ma need y'all to smash that like button. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. This is the amount of people that watch me and aren't subscribed. <laughs> That's crazy, it's free bro, just click the button bro. Click the like button and click the subscribe button. That's all I need. This video needs 50 likes. I know y'all was bucking with the last video. Y'all was bucking with the last video, you feel me? Like, you know what I'm saying? I get my 50, I'ma need my 50, okay? 50 likes, that's all I need, you feel me? That's all I need. But I'm not gonna keep y'all waiting for too long. Let's hop straight into the story time. Now this story time takes place in about about October, right? Everything that I'm about to say takes place in Tallahassee, Florida. Yes, Tallahassee, Florida, aka College Town, aka where everybody in college, everybody in university goes to turn up. At the time, I'm in school, right? You feel me? I'm taking my classes and whatnot, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm in college and stuff. I had a great idea, you know what I'm saying? I had a great idea to go to homecoming for FAMU and FSU homecoming. You feel me? Who is saying no to FAMU, FSU homecoming? You know what I'm saying? As a as an 18 year old man, I heard about how you know what I'm saying college get lit, how the college life is, the fast life. You feel me? Uh, aside from you know what I'm saying, all the people that's really getting their degrees. You know what I'm saying? Like shout out to y'all, y'all boys, y'all boys really doing y'all thing right now. I just wanted to get a little taste. I just wanted a little taste of what the college life really looking like you know what i'm saying so i knew who was going with me i made sure i knew everything like i had the bnb ready everything ready you know what i'm saying we i really planned this out and when i kid you not when i kid y'all not bro this was probably the most fun i've ever had in my adult life so far i don't even know how to explain it words cannot explain it bro i had probably the most fun i've ever had in my life bro i was outside I was outside, bro. I was outside and I was deep. I had my peoples with me, you know what I'm saying? I had my homeboys with me. We was all lit. Words can't even explain it. Like, I gotta pull up videos of y'all, bro. I knew we was lit by the first day, you feel me? We stayed there for about 10 days, six, seven days, you feel me? I already knew we was gonna be the, like, I already knew we was gonna be lit by the first day. Let me tell y'all why. We go to this club, you know what I'm saying? We go to this club slash lounge slash I don't know what to call it, you feel me? They call this shit Mayhem Monday, bro. It was exactly how it sounds. Mayhem, bro. All my homeboys just dripped out. All my people was dripped out, you know what I'm saying? We all lit. We waiting in line for the club, you know what I'm saying? Usually club lines really be long, but we get there type early. So we only waiting in line for 15, 20 minutes, you know what I'm saying? Usually the club line be like an hour. And on top of that, it's a white boy working security, right? This man gonna ask me if I wanna pay $20 for 21 band, you know what I'm saying? Cause now you can get your little drinks, allegedly, you feel me? And I'm like, hell yeah, like hook me up fam. I'm trying to cash out the man, you know what I'm saying? I'm in line trying to cash out this man, right? Bro, it's not going through it, he says, Did you send it? I'm like, hell yeah, no one damn well that shit ain't go through. We was out that bit for free. But I'm free. We get inside this club, bro. When we get inside, it hasn't even been 30 minutes, bro. I kid you not. And this bitch is already jumping, bro. Like, I don't know how. Like, it got deep quick. This, pla this place is huge. I'm drunk. I'm lit. And I'm ready to have fun. And for those of y'all that know me in real life, bro, like, I don't hold, like, I don't let up. Like, 
I do not let up. When I'm in the club, I'm here for the moment. I'm going to turn my ass up. Bro, I'm in the middle of the dance floor doing splits, man. I'm I'm bugged, bro. I'm turning up like I'm a party. You just call me a party animal. I don't consider myself that. I just consider myself the life of the party. You know what I'm saying? I hate to talk about myself like that, but that's exactly what I am. I'm the, you feel me? Do not let me get started on these F. A-M-U females, bro. These historically black educated females. It hasn't even been an hour yet, bro. And there's so much beautiful black women on the dance floor. Shout out to FAMU, bro. I have never seen so many beautiful black women in one place at one time, bro. I was sick, bro. Like, like my jaw dropped. Like, I love, like, I established my, 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 infatuation my love my obsession with black women once i stepped on that campus bro and there's so many beautiful women in the club y'all let me tell y'all what really like like what really made my night that night you feel me i'm probably an hour in you know what i'm saying i had a couple of things to drink you know what i'm saying i'm not a big avid drinker i had a little some some you know what i'm saying now nah, I was drinking. I ain't, gonna, I ain't gonna lie. I was, I was drunk. I was drunk. It, this is like, this really happened. Like, this was straight out of a movie. Bro, we in the middle of the floor, right? We all turn our head to the right in slow motion, right? Bro, tell me how we see this section. It's a big section, right? It's about 50 beautiful, sexy, exquisite, melanated women just turning up. It was not one ugly female in there, bro. It was scrape bad bitches in that motherfucker, bro. I was like, oh! Like, our jaw dropped. If y'all was there, bro, Mayhem Monday, bro, you remember? Bro, I don't know. I don't even know how to explain it, bro. Like, that was probably the best night of my life. But now that y'all get a gist of what was going on, you know what I'm saying? First day we lit. Bro, let me tell y'all about day two, bro. This is where the story gets crazy. We lit, you know what I'm saying? As usual. And we deep as usual we was probably bro that trip i gotta pull up a picture and show y'all bro like we had to be like 20 deep bro and day two we decided to go to this club called bajas right all my florida people all my tally people especially y'all know about bajas it's a club you know what i'm saying everybody goes there you know what i'm saying all that so we pull up to bajas right and for those of y'all that do not know bro if y'all not about that club life bro you need to buy a ticket, bro. You need to buy a ticket, bro, because these promoters are going to tell you it's free before 11, free before 12, free before whatever. Bro, if you get that and you don't buy a ticket, you're grits. You're not getting in that club, bro. You're not getting in unless you pay at the door, which they probably going to upcharge the hell out of you. And I make sure I bought mine, you know what I'm saying? I don't know about the rest of my homeboys and all that. We get there, right? And there's this fat-ass line. It's this fat ass line, bro. It's not even a line, bro. It's mad people. It's long, you feel me? And it's fat, bro. It's people just clumped together. It's cold outside. It's a whole bunch of black motherfuckers, you feel me? We snuggled up like penguins waiting in the line, you know what I'm saying? It wasn't even a line. It was just a big huddle, bro. Like, I don't even know how to explain it to y'all, bro. We're literally leaning on everybody else. This is how close we are, bro. So we shimmying our way into the line, you know what I'm saying? We talking. We in this line for about... Probably like an hour or some change, bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. So we trying to get to the front of the line. Mind y'all, I said we're like 20 deep, bro. Like, we are deep as hell, bro. Like, it's a lot of us, you know what I'm saying? A lot of my friends, a lot of my peoples, bro. We are deep. Next thing you know, all them boys just start popping out the line, popping out the line. All of my friends start getting out the line. I'm like, bro, where the fuck is y'all going? So next thing you know, boom, 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 the line start rushing up. Niggas see niggas popping out, niggas going home. Oh, niggas trying to get to the front of the line, you feel me? JP is not getting out the line, bro. One thing about my cousin, bro, one thing about my cousin, my cousin is not missing out on nothing, bro. He told me straight up. He said, that's fine. You know what I'm saying? Them boys can get out the line, but I'm getting in. And I'm like, I'm not going nowhere neither. W man. We, we, we good anywhere we go, but I'm not leaving my cousin by himself. Straight up, I do not care, bro. So it's just me, it's just JP and my dog Pat, right? We end up getting inside, right? We end up getting inside. We in the club, I'm feeling myself. I'm fresh, you know what I'm saying? I got my shades on. These not even my shades. I don't know how I got these shades, right? And it's dark, bro. It's dark. Remember that. That's, that's a very important part of the story. I can't see nothing, right? But I feel... Feel me? I feel exquisite. You know why? Let me tell y'all why. The first thing we do is go to the bar. I need my vodka Sprite. 
Sorry. It's, it's mad females in there. It's motherfuckers throwing money. I'm slick putting that shit in my pocket because I'm reimbursing myself for what I pay to get inside of here. You know what I'm saying? Now, all of a sudden, a strange substance ends up in my hand. I'm like, how'd this get here? You feel me? Because I ain't bring you with me. Fuck it. I'm a partake. I am faded, bro. I am faded, bro. I have my shades on. I am on another planet, bro. I'm not doing nothing else. Let me go to the dance floor. I'm feeling the music, the music loud, I like it. Let me, let me just vibe, right? All I remember is somehow some girl, I didn't even see her face, she just end up in front of me, right? I'm not making no rational decisions, but I'm like, fuck it. This girl end up on my, you feel me? We getting a little touchy, you feel me? And my, my people's right there next to me, right? JP right next to me. I low key forgot them boys was even there. I ain't even gonna lie, bro. Cause when this girl was behind me, this girl, this girl, <laughs> Oh, this girl was going crazy. I ain't gonna lie. She knew what she, bro. She knew what she was doing, right? So this girl throwing it back on me, though. I ain't gonna lie. Like this is where the, this is where the story gets spicy, right? I'm grinding on her hard. Well, like we is like, but we basically we 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 really fucking with, with clothes on at this point. And I don't even know how she looks, bro. Cause I got my shades on. She did not turn around not one time, bro. And at this point, you know, you boy, I knew she knew, bro. Cause she had to feel it, bro. Like. I'm a, I'm a horn, like, I'm a horny nigga, bro. Like, I ain't gonna lie to y'all, bro. So, I start doing all this crazy stuff, bro. They playing freaky music, you feel me? They playing at City Girls, playing all this crazy music, right? And I'm whispering the freaky lyrics in her ear, bro. Like, I'm grabbing this girl by the throat. I'm grabbing on her. And guess what? She's liking it. This girl is letting me just have a field day with her, bro. And the whole time I'm doing this, right? <laughs> the whole time I'm doing this, JP right next to me, feel me? I'm in his ear, bro. I'm in his ear and I'm telling him, bro, does she look good, bro? I need to know because I have my glasses on and I'm fried as frick. He's like, I don't know because her hair was on her face. It's all poofy, you know what I'm saying? I need to know how this girl looks, you feel me? Because I... I don't know. And let me tell y'all, I came in with Pat and then my other cousin came in, right? So he's right there, Pat's right there. It's, they see how this girl looks, bro. They don't say nothing. You put that drink in my hand, bro. It's another side of me that come out, bro. But yeah, bro, I'm doing all this crazy stuff and she's letting me, bro. She's letting me. So long story short, you feel me? The nice ending and she gotta go cause she came with her friends, right? So her friends told her she gotta go, right? So this girl finally turns around and I'm skeptical on how she looks. But I can't see nothing, bro. I got 5% tints on my eyelids, bro. These glasses are not going, bro. I can't see shit. I can't make out, like, I can't make out a thing, bro. It's too dark in there, you feel me? I don't know how she looked for real. All I remember is her saying, Give me your phone. So I give her my phone. She puts her number in my phone, you feel me? And I'm like, fuck you. Like, we'll see what happens in the morning, you know what I'm saying, when I leave. So we end up leaving the club, you know what I'm saying? I go back to the BNB. So I wake up in the morning, right? All I remember is that I asked her for her IG, right? <laughs> this girl sends me her IG, right? I click on it. Y'all, this girl was ugly. And I hate to say that, bro. I hate to say that, bro, because, like, you feel me? I made her night. She loaded. She made mine. I. <laughs> but I'm like, yo, this girl is ugly, bro. This girl does not look good at all. When I tell y'all, she was a gremlin. A real life gremlin. Like, Bro, scale of one to ten, one, bro. Baby, if you're watching this, if, if you know this is you, I'm sorry. Lord forgive me, cause I was really, I was really bugged out. Bro, I see, I see this, bro. I was like, yo! I'm looking at Pat, I'm like, bro, y'all really let me do that with that girl, bro? L man! That's L man's activity, bro. This girl did not look good at all, bro. That shit was, that shit was hilarious, bro. Oh my gosh, like that, bro, that whole week was it was something else bro moral of the story bro don't wear shades in the club especially it's a dark club you feel me do not wear shades in the club because it's going to hurt you bad also don't drink don't do drugs be sober feel me be 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 mindful of your surroundings be mindful of what you you're doing bro. yeah that's pretty much the end of this video feel me um i'm glad i got it to y'all feel me if you got a good laugh out of it you know what i'm saying you got a good 
ha ha he he out of this, you feel me? Make sure y'all smash that like button once again, you know what I'm saying? If y'all see me in a spot with an ugly girl and I got shades on again, smack me in my head, bro, because I'm never letting that happen ever again. If you made it to the end of this video, if you haven't hit the subscribe button at this point, bro, there's something wrong with you mentally, bro. Make sure you hit the button. It's free! And I'm gonna need 50 likes once again, bro. I need 50 likes on this video, you know what I'm saying? So these... These story times, these experiences can keep on happening. And I can keep giving y'all what y'all like. I gotta give the people what they want, right? But I appreciate y'all for watching this video. If it made you laugh, if it made you get have a good kiki, ha ha he he moment, I'm glad you did, you know what I'm saying? Thank you for watching this video. And without further ado, I'm out.